Okay, I'm outside Cinema Secrets. This is one of the best places in all of Los Angeles to get your Halloween costume. And we wonder why our country's running low on energy. I'm headed in. This is interesting. The deal with a lot of Halloween masks is they're avoiding copyright infringement. This is not a Guy Fieri costume. This is celebrity chef wig. This is not a Donald Trump costume. It's a you're fired wig. This is clearly Steven Tyler. So they're not fooling anybody. These are apparently gangster braids. I guess they're gangster braids if it's 1996 and you're being electrocuted. This is tragic. Uh, this costume right here actually got an innocent man killed by SEAL Team 6. There's a whole section up here of historical costumes for kids that want to get beat up real fast. Here's a blast from the past. This was my Halloween costume when I was 11. I was Teddy Roosevelt. I was wedgied 35 times that night. Presidential election just days away. We got all kinds of political masks. We got Barack Obama. I think this is uh, an Asian Schwarzenegger. And then this is weird, two Mitt Romney masks. One is pale and one is burned. I don't know why there's two Romneys. Maybe because there are, in fact, two Mitt Romneys. That was a political comment I just made. But he's changed his position, so it's two of them. I think it's time to meet somebody who works here at the store. This is Robin, is that your name? Robin. Hey Robin, how are you? I'm good, how are you? There's a common phenomenon, which is the sexy girl costume. Mm -hmm. I like to see them on people and occasionally wear them myself. Do you have a section here of sexy girl costumes? We do, yeah. They were taking me to a separate section. How's it going? It's going good. What are you doing at the sexy girl section? <laughs> Who's this woman right here? I'm just the mom. You're the mom? Let me get this straight. You bring your mom to the sexy girl costume section? What's going on? I actually brought him. Oh, you brought him? Yeah. Even stranger. You want to see the sexy girl costume? This is the maid. The sexy maid is a big one. She's just here to clean up. Oh, monsieur. Oh, you're naked. No, I'm naked. Ah, B. The B means honey, but watch out for her sting. You're quickly going extinct for reasons we don't understand. Okay, you just found my favorite. I love a cat suit. I just think it's so hot. Can you do me a favor? Just rub this against my chest. Just rub it against my chest. I'm gonna close my eyes and you say, good kitty. Ah! I may have a new favorite, bacon dress. This is combining two of my favorite things, bacon and women's clothing. They have a great series here, the douchebag series. This is night douchebag, you can get pirate douchebag, or just douchebag. Okay, Robin, I couldn't help but notice these fake beards and mustaches are outrageously expensive. Check this out. This little mustache alone is $159.99. I believe the markup on this is $159.98. Why are these so expensive? Well, some of them are made out of human hair and some of them are like... Wait a minute, wait, wait, wait. There's some of these up here that are human hair? So this isn't a costume store you're running. This is a serial killer's dungeon. Now here's a very interesting phenomenon, which is our desire at Halloween to turn little kids, babies, into food. This is a little cupcake girl, baby ice cream cone. Here's baby banana, baby hot dog. I don't understand this need to make children dress up as something edible. They're delicious as is. What are we looking at here? These all appear to be different kinds of wounds. Yes. And they're very realistic. This is a guy who's got a horrible burn. This is me after about, I think, 15 minutes at any beach in Rhode Island. Scars, Jay Leno. Pretty common problem named Rex. So out of your face. I like his face, is a, his expression is mild annoyance. Oh, man. I like this one. This is turn of the century Andy Richter. 1908. 1908. And why is this guy here? This is a guy who just accidentally became a wizard. I don't know why he's in the terrible wounds section. Okay, quick question. What the hell's going on with this? I just noticed that. 
You just noticed this? Just noticed. You didn't know that you were selling uh-uh. a Conan O'Brien mask. I have one question for you. Explain the title. Life like a 66 year old man child. Watch him desperately try to win your approval. Uh, this is very accurate. I'm still on the air. Why are you all laughing at me? I used to be on network. I've never been more attracted to anyone than to you right now. This is my kink, by the way. This is what I'm into, is I get ladies to put this on, and then I'm with me all night long. Okay, that does it for me. Good night, and happy Halloween. Halloween.